today's the day. Um, have been a little bit cryptic as to what I'm doing. A few people have found out, mostly because I've told them, but I've had a long goal of completing the Turrogan to Stratford Rail Trail. It's the Gippsland Plains Rail Trail. Um, I was thinking on the way over here, I'd like to start by how I'm feeling. People know I've been through a bit lately. Um, still feeling pretty upset, like I'm on the verge of being upset now, if you couldn't tell. Um, I'm nervous as all fuck about this. Um, I know I've done a longer distance, but that was with support. This will be my longest unassisted run. I've got my hiking pack. I did take photos and put it up on Facebook. So there's my hiking pack. I've got two litres of water in the bladder. I've then got an additional 1.8 litres in bottles that I'll put in my bladder when I need it. I've got almond butter, I've got soy sauce, I've got bread, I've got chocolates if I need it, and I've got my anti-chafe. I was trying that squirrel's nut butter, but I found it too hard to apply, so I've gone back to the body glide for today, going with what works. It's a beautiful day out here today. It's like right here. I'm finding it hard to breathe. Um, and a little bit up here. I think I'm going to go through a lot today. I'm going to run for as long as I can. I'm surprised how well I was able to run yesterday with my hiking pack on. Uh, at Coonwara Park Run. I'm not sure at what point during this run I'll tell people what I'm doing. Maybe if I get five people telling me or asking me what I'm doing, or by the time I get to Tungabi, then I'll tell them. All right, so here's the map. I'm starting down here. I'll make it to Glengarry. It's about five k's, I think, or just over five kilometers till there. Then the next, the stretch from there to Glengarry is a bit more lengthy. All the way up to Kawa is another long stretch. I've only ever done that once. Once. Kawa to Hayfield, I've never done. Hayfield to Tanamba, I've never done. I have done... Yeah, Tanamba to Mafra, I haven't done. I've done a little bit. Um, Mafra to Stratford I have done. I have actually started at Stratford and gone out to Mafra and a little way to Tatanamba, but I haven't gone all the way. So from Kawa, we're from here all the way to about here, roughly. I have no concept, this bit here is on the road, so I get to Kawa, we do a left, I actually, no, there's a bit here, no, that bit right there, I remember getting to here, and I was actually going down here, I was going the wrong way, uh, I ended up getting someone picking me up, so technically I haven't done that little bit there, but it's not very far, um, I don't know what to expect today, get shit out of my beard, sorry, I'm looking at me more than the camera um it's now 10 past seven exactly <laughs> uh i think i'm just gonna get into it my phone didn't charge all the way last night for some reason but i'm going to record what i can <sighs> yep i'm just gonna go i'll try and put some music on along the way <laughs> Keep me going. Wish me luck, guys. Bye. Okay, guys. 1.56 kilometers in. Gate number one. Judged by the... Oh, 
not judged, but because of it being closer. Now, gate number two. Hello, cow. Okay, bye, cow. Sucks you have to turn the videos off uh, to just flip the camera, unless I'm doing it wrong. Uh, I wonder if I should do a few yeah boys on this adventure. Look at that long rail. <laughs> <Try. sighs> right, let's give it a go. I don't know, maybe that's a... Six out of ten, maybe. I don't know. You guys judge. Rank eight. Yeah, boy. As I go. Bye. Okay, I think this is gate number four. Listen, we had one, two, three, four. This is five. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy! There's another gate there. It's on the other side of the fence. I'm not counting it. All right? There. So, gate number five. Remember that, Matty. Yeah, boy! Yeah, memories. I've already forgotten. <laughs> so this is six or seven. <sighs> Nearly at Glengarry. Three kilometers in. Okay, here I am. Glengarry. Took me just over 36 minutes to get here for 4.9 k's. And as you can tell, it was uh, Yeah, stopping at gates, taking photos. I've seen some yellow-tailed black cockatoos. Um, I was gonna stop here and check my bag, but I might wait till I get to uh, Toon Gabby. Uh, so, it's about eight k's from here now. Or eight and a half, nine and a half, somewhere to get to the next town. I did have a fair bit of a run at a constant pace just coming into Glengarry, which was nice. It was like six minute to 6.30 pace on average from when I seen it anyway. Uh, yeah. Still a lot going on in my head. Mel trees. Hello. The hmm. Um, yep, can we get to it? Bye. Ooh, okay. One hour, 34 minutes, 50 seconds. And Lauren just messaged me. Hello Lauren. Here I am at Toon Gabby, so town number two. There's a second bridge back there as well, but I didn't record the first one. Um, and just to prove I am where I am, walk up to this sign. <sighs> <sighs> had a really long stretch of running. I ran almost that whole length of the uh, rail trail um, between Glengarry and Toongabby. Can't remember what I stopped for, if I did. I think I just need to have a quick piss, <laughs> um, which is good. I'm gonna keep walking up here. This will this is starting to get to the more uncommon parts of the trail for me. Um, 
Hello Mark V, you just commented on my Facebook page. Uh, so, I get to the end of town, I'm gonna take my pack off for a little bit. And I'll have my first um butter and soy sauce sandwich. Um, sweating a little bit. But it was good to have a nice smooth pace, I was going to walk. And then I'm like, oh, I'm not that far from Toon Gabby. I'm just gonna keep going. Look, I'm not running fast. People know I can run faster than this, but oh, well, I'm just here to get, get it done. And hopefully not too late in the day so I can go home and rest. Maybe have a nice big steak and maybe a glass of red wine. I don't know. I was telling people I wasn't going to drink red wine again. Um, that's a nice seat. Maybe I should sit there. Um, yeah, stuff, I'm going to sit there. Um, take this backpack off, have some food, and continue on. Oh, I didn't press my watch. I'm doing a lap, the laps on my run today from town to town. Uh, it's, I'm basically in the middle of town now anyway, so that's all right. Anyway, time for food. See you guys soon. Okay, one quick video to post. This will be the one that tells everyone, I guess. So I've had a goal for a long time to do the entire Gippsland Plains Rail Trail. It runs from Terrelgan to Glengarry, to Toongabi, to Hayfield, to Mafra, to Tenamba, to Stratford. It's, oh no, I'm probably getting some of those towns mixed up. Right now I am 13.6 k's in. I'm not aiming for a really fast time, though I do think I'll be the first person to do this. Definitely the first person I know. And I can't see anyone else that's crazy enough to do this in a day. Uh, so the entire length is 63 kilometers and yeah so I've got like six no 50 k's to go now so this is going to be my longest unassisted run and yeah longest unassisted by like 23 k's providing the information I got is correct going all the way to Stratford um, so yeah I've had a fair stretch of running. Uh, if this goes well, eventually I want to have a goal to do up and back, so it would be a 126 kilometre adventure, but that'll be a whole weekend thing. Anyway guys, I'm gonna get back to it and see you soon, bye. Okay, here's gate number seven. Uh, I think it's seven. I've lost count. <laughs> Uh, so this is going into Tungabi to Kawar now. I've only ever done this stretch of the rail trail once before, so I can't remember how far it is, but all I know is I've still got just under 50 k's to go for this adventure. I don't think my phone battery is going to last, so I'm going to preserve it. So here's a yeah boy! Got a lot of people around. I need to stop caring what they think. Yeah, boy! That was shit. That was fucking horrible. Okay, I have to try that again. All right, get it together, matey. I'm still looking for people. <laughs> um. <sighs> Love that. Where's my year boy spirit? I wait until this patch here. Concealed in my protection from the trees and the sun. Or protection from the trees to be protecting me from the sun. Yep, fun times ahead.
Yeah, boy! I like that one. Shit, I didn't record all that. Oh, God damn it! I thought I did. Oh. Um, I think I've shown both the gates. There was two gates. I had to do two year boys and the second one was really good. All right, I'll just do them again. <sighs> Summon thy spirit again. Thy year boy spirit. So I don't know what I've missed out on recording. Um, okay. Yeah, boy number one for the first gate back there. <sighs> See if I can confuse these cows a little bit more than anyone else that can hear me by that house over there. <sighs> I'm just getting sore from holding the phone up. <sighs> Three, two, one. And go. Yeah, boy! That was good. All right, I need one more. My forearm really hurts when I do that, actually. I've actually been gripping onto these really tight. I think there's people up there, actually. Who cares? Okay, last one before. I can confirm there's people there. Yeah, boy! Okay. Oh, there's another gate there. I'm not doing that one. I'm just gonna keep going. Bye, guys. Okay, so I think it was gate number 11 back there that I took a photo of. Didn't do a yeah, boy, because two people were riding by on bikes, and I don't think it would be too good to scare them. <laughs> They stopped and asked what I'm up to, and I go, I'm just going to Stratford. And they're like, oh, okay, what's after that? I'm like, someone's picking me up and driving me back home. <laughs> and they're like, oh, okay, by the looks of it, it looks like you're going to Western Australia. And it's like, after that, I'm thinking about it, I'm going, it's the wrong way to be going to Western Australia. Should be going the other way. This is going to New South Wales. Or closer to it, I don't know. I'm very shit with directions, but why well, I say it, Western Australia is that way, not that way. What does my watch say? Where is my compass? Okay, north is that way. Well, that way. So, Western Australia is further that way. So, I'm going the opposite direction. Yeah. Anyway, I should be doing a year boy and not draining my battery so much. I was just thinking in my head. It's like, it's like I summon the almighty year boy spirit. Man, spirits lately. I might explain it to people one day. A couple might know what I'm on about. But anyway, I'm just getting sore. <sighs> Let's go for a really long, loud one. Let's aim for a 10. This is going to be a 10. <sighs> Slow my pace down. Get my breathing right. <sighs> yeah! Okay, it wasn't very long. It's kind of loud though. I don't think it's a 10. That's not a 10. Maybe eight, eight and a half. <laughs> I'll get a nine first. Bye. Okay. Gate number 12, roughly. <sighs> Starting to get pretty warm. So I think a lot of this is going to be walked now. I'll have to take my buff off. <clears throat> I think I'm nearly at Kala, but it doesn't seem right. I know we do a road crossing, but 
I thought it was further along. If I'm right, this road crossing will mean I'm only like 1k away from Hajeni, from Kawa roughly. But I'm only at 19k's, so it doesn't seem right. Like I feel like it should be at least another five, maybe. Five or six. Anyway. Yeah, boy! That was shit. I just felt like getting it done. Yep. Wave to the random car. Oh, there's another gate there. So, we'll get to that one. Actually, no, it feels like this might be right. I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm only 1k away. Anyway, there's another gate here. I might as well keep recording. Authorised vehicles only. Oh, I better not go on there. Hmm. I'm a bit of a vehicle. Right. I'm going to guess number 13 for that gate. <sighs> All right. I summon the yeah boy spirit. I haven't seen any more feathers. <sighs> Slow the pace. Takes a lot of effort to get the, to the right frame for a yeah boy. Yeah boy! Ah, <laughs> uh, it does make you feel better. It does get rid of a big built up feeling in your chest. <sighs> See you soon. 19 kilometers, the point three, uh, 19.38 kilometers. I got a message from someone saying that I'm going to smash this and that they're going to be stalking me on Facebook and Messenger to see how I'm going. You know who you are. Thank you. I appreciate your support. I hope you get to see this video as well. Just for you, I'm going to do one very mighty yeah boy. Let's aim for that 10. I know I can do it. Felt good. It's like, yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah. <sighs> Epic. See you soon. Can't believe I nearly missed the gate. Come on, land care. I think the road crossing I was talking about is just up ahead. I go to the road, I turn left, and then I cut back out onto the rail trail. And then I think it's 1k. And then I'll be in Kawa. Oh, oh there's a sign there, it says Kawa. Oh, that works. I'm okay with that. <laughs> there's a nice seat here. Um, welcome to Kawa. So, yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. 
Boy! So, I've told this to one person. She knows who she is. I don't think I've told anyone else. Um, during the Yu Yang's 100 kilometer, I found when I was struggling or wanting to get to the next aid spot, I wanted to sing. And it's like, it feels different today. I'm feeling pretty good. So I don't know if I'll end up putting this on or not. But it's like a song came to my head and I thought about it the other day and perhaps singing just a little bit of it as horrible of a sinner as I am <sighs> I don't know I reckon I'm a horrible sinner oh there's a crested pigeon distracted I don't know if you'll be able to see it it's right in the middle of the trail wobbling his head Hello crested pigeon, you're going to fly off soon aren't you, or are you going to follow me, or am I following you, you're going to come to Stratford with me, that we're going to go. <sighs> Don't know if you've seen it or not, um, yep it's gone. The song I really like, as sad as it is, is Dream Theatre well it's someone just messaged me someone um yeah the uh blah 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 I do not say blah 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 yeah it's gonna be a long day anyway the song is Goodnight Kiss by Dream Theatre and I just really love the start of it. It's like, Good night, kiss in your nightgown, lavender in your bed. No, I'm stuffing that up. Good night, kiss in your nightgown, lavender in your bed. So innocent as you lie down Those bastard doctors are gonna pay Are you lonely without mommy's love? I want you to know I'd die for one more moment you're just a poor girl Afraid of this cruel world Taken away from it all Sorry, I'm just visualizing the music in my head Yeah. Oh, I like that part. So it's been five years to the day. A tainted love still the same. Let yeah. to think of another song. I'll be back. I'm going to say gate number 13 or 14 here. The area is quite nice out here. I can't see where that bird just went. It was like, oh, it's up way high now. Be a harrier or something. A kite of sorts. I think I hear a roof of sunlark. Dawson connection. So where are we? You are here. So, oh yeah, I need to 
Get the bridge. The gate. Yeah, boy! So weird, that one. So I'm there, I have to go 500 metres down there to the road, walk along the road for 2.6 k's and I get to Dawson Road. It goes towards Hayfield and then there's Dawson Flora Reserve. I connect back onto the rail trail there. All right, just so there's a reference point, so I'm that red dot, I'm gonna go up here, up this part here, and then across, and then back onto the rail trail there. Once I'm back on the rail trail, that's apparently 4.5 k's, so 2.6, 2.4, that's five, so I'm about nine, nine and a half k's. I'll be there in about two hours at this rate. It doesn't matter, who cares. I feel like I need to do a better yeah boy though. Yeah boy! Yeah! I'm sorry, baby. <laughs> so, chip, 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 chip. Boop, 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 boop. So, there's uh. It is getting warm out here. I've been sticking to the shade as much as I can. But right now, there's a. Uh, Sprinkler. Right there. He's like, oh, I just don't want to get wet by that by now. Right now. There's like little bits of mist that's getting me, but I don't know what's in that water if they're doing pesticides or whatever as well, or if it's just water. Oh, that mist is nice. That's it. Oh, it's getting close. It's getting close. Look at this. A little bit closer. Oh, there it comes. There it comes. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. oh that felt good. One more. I wonder if it hits the same spot every time. Oh, it didn't get me that time. Come on. Oh, the mist did. Right, let's do this. There is it. Here it comes. Oh, miss me. God damn it. <sighs> okay. Yes, yeah, still getting really warm, but I'm now at Dawson. So from here, it should be 4.5 k's to Hayfield. I've got a sign coming up here, Dawson Connection. You are here. Dawson Flora Reserve Hay Rail Trail to Hayfield. 4.5 kilometers. <sighs> We've got a gate here. I have, um, have I done a lap? I don't know if I pressed lap just now. Shit. Um, I'll press it again, just in case. But here's the gate. <sighs> Need to have a piss. <sighs> All right, time for a year, boy. I've only got 20% left on my phone, so I'm conserving it just for key points. This is a nice gate. Very nice gate. There's a bench there. Might have a sit down. Uh, yeah, I'll sit down and have some water and a bit of food. <sighs> oh, I really need to pee. <laughs> Yeah, boy. Season guard. Good timing. Yeah, good timing to get to that gate. Those people riding down now. Oh, it's an uh, open, well, closed gate. Um, so yeah, open it up, close it for them. Feel like that deserves a big yeah, boy. That's a double gate there. So it's like 
14, 15 gates now. Oh, had a chat with a few people. They caught up to me as I sat down just before and they're riding bikes and had a bit of a chat and they're like, oh, we're just going to Tanamba and back. And they live in Toongabi or something. And they're like, we're not going anywhere near Stratford and we're on bikes. And it, it like sinks in. I've still got so much further to go. Ah. Uh, yeah. But I'll get there. Hopefully before my phone goes flat so I can call and say I'm done. All right. Yeah. Not yet. Okay. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Yeah! Boy! I think I'm getting worse. I need to do an epic one soon. Bye, guys. Okay. Must be getting close to... to Amber. I just crossed the road and here's a gate and now we keep going <sighs> but guess what guys guess what yeah boy yeah <sighs> I was hoping to get at least one more of those in See? wetlands water spirit Thank you. Oh, baby, I love the way every day. I want to be with you night and day. Uh, that's one gate. Might as well keep recording to the next gate. I've lost count of how many gates. Oh, poor birdie got hit. There's a dead birdie on the road. Rest in peace, baby. <sighs> Can't get to this gate and do a mighty yeah boy. Yeah boy. And here's the next gate. Oh, right, I'm surprised this last 10% of the phone is lasting so long. Oh, no idea how far I am from the next town now. Um, <clears throat> Alright, let's do this. I like that one. Okay, 42.59 kilometers. I have overshot the marathon distance. I was going to record this on 42.2. It's like, so congratulations, you have completed a marathon. Now keep moving! I see gates, I see a beautiful gate, and another gate over there. I shall touch each gate, because that is what I do. There's another, where is it? There it is, I'm touching the gate, I touch the gate. I shall cross the road. So I hope a train doesn't come along this rail trail. Ha ha ha, funny, not. Anyway, next gate. Another fly lands on my face. Blah, 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 blah. Yep, I've come to the conclusion. I'm talking a lot of shit at the moment. Well, another gate, another gate. There it is. It's really warm out here. Need to keep drinking water. But guess what? It's time for a yeah boy. A yeah boy. A yeah boy. A yeah boy. Yeah boy. Yeah. <laughs> it's like welcome to Matty's Gates. Matty's Gateway. <sighs> 
I like beautiful places like this. <sighs> Memory spirit. And a gate right by the Tanamba uh, sign. So it's like, yeah, boy! Time to get a drink. I need some lemonade or something. Bye. Alrighty, continuing on. Now doing the eight kilometre stretch from Tanambra to Tanamba to Mafra. Uh, yeah, a little bit of chafing on my back or my right marks from the backpack. I'll put some body glide on. I'll do what I can to fix that. Um, anyway, need a year boy for that gate, don't I? So it's like. Need to build up to it. Yeah, boy! Yeah, boy. So many thoughts going through my head. I'm getting closer to Mafra. I'm like, uh, let's see what my watch says. Five, four k's away, uh, roughly, maybe a bit less. And this, I don't know what to feel, what to know, how to think, how to do anything. It's like, this is in relations to the goal. It's like, it's been such a long time since I've thought about doing this. Why haven't I done it sooner? I'm not saying this is easy. I'm not saying this is hard. I'm just getting this done. This is something that I want to do. And one thing that goes through my mind is, yes, it's so easy to give up after such heartbreaking events that leave you shattered and destroyed and leaving you to have a meltdown at your local pub. And it's so easy to stop everything. You think, you think about all the things that could have been, what you've missed out, that one thing that you desired, that someone you desired, that object, that goal, that dream, that passion, that thing that drives you to keep on going, to not just be stagnant, not to be caught up in one's cantankerous thoughts, fighting battles in your head, and raging wars when there should be peace. We're only here once, and I don't really feel like being sad. I feel like doing everything that I can to keep going forward, to keep pushing myself. And I know sooner or later this goal will be small compared to what I will accomplish in the future. And all these cows are looking at me now. <laughs> They're listening to my words of advice. Stay strong, stay beautiful, keep going, keep moving, keep eating, laugh and grow fat. <laughs> As Fat Man would say from Metal Gear Solid, that's my second third point for the day. And just live your life. I can hardly see myself because there's smudges on the screen and I've done the brightness so that I can record this. I don't know if this is going to drain the rest of my battery or not, but I hope I get to stop it and save it before the phone dies. So for now, listen to my words. And just keep moving. Yes, it sucks to have been hurt and heartbroken. And I will always remember everything and I will be looking forward to the day that that spirit returns. I don't think anything truly ends but everything just goes on pause. Every part of your life you do little bits and pieces here and there. There's no need to say goodbye, there's no need to dwell in sorrows when you know that there'll be a time when 
that shall continue, that shall uplift you and you will do what you desire, what you dream, what your passion is, what your goal is, what your heart yearns for and you'll keep fighting, you will stop being stagnant, you will push for what you really want. I would like to think that I'm a living example of that. People know who I used to be, what I used to be, and I, for one, know exactly who I used to be and who I do not want to be anymore. There's no point living in the past, as they say. Just live now, do what you can do now. I said this speech a few times now. You just have to keep going. I think that is all for now. I shall reach the end of my journey and I shall remember what I have gone through today, what I've endured, what I've struggled with and what I pushed through. This is not the last time I will be here on this path, this journey. There's a water spirit, flowing water. Thank you. I'll be looking forward to some shade, getting to the next checkpoint and continuing on. The day is nearly at an end for me and I shall eat lots. <laughs> I shall do many things and I shall sleep and I shall go to work tomorrow and I will continue living my life for that is why I am here. And then Tuesday I will bathe in the waters of Inverloch maybe. That, that almighty spirit, <laughs> That's, that ocean, soothe my legs and heal my fatigued body. Why the hell? Uh, feel like I just got stinging nettle on my foot. I shall call it at that for this video. I shall see you soon in Mafra. <sighs> really warm, rest in this shade. And I hear a whistling kite. <sighs> Mighty bird of prey. You probably hear it in the background. <sighs> I must be very close to Mafra. <sighs> the gate and water spirit. <sighs> There's like two dams there. Legs are getting very tired. Still not quite in Mafra. So I've still got over 10 k's to go. It's getting hard now. People probably know where this part is. Anyway. Let's get rid of some cobwebs, hey? So many cars, don't give a shit. Yeah, boy! <sighs> I can do better than that. <sighs> right, three, two, one. <sighs> Maybe I still do care about people going by. I should be on the final stretches for the rail trail now. Let's see what it says. Stratford to Mafra, 10 kilometers. Hold the hand still. So close. 10 k's guys, 10 more. I think I'm starting to hit the wall. I'm so close though, 
My legs are so sore. Just need to keep moving. There's a bench up here. Might stop. See how it goes. Okay, so close. I was wondering if I was ever going to see a gate again, let alone two. It's up to the gate, Maddie. That's one. Let me get to the next gate. There's three there. So close. Yeah, boy! Come on, Maddie. Finish this. <laughs>